thank you for buying your wig from Wig Designs. So you have purchased a wig from Wig Designs and uh, you have spent a lot of money for that. And uh, it's really important to maintain the wig to reduce wear and tear. So uh, we have few accessories here. So how to? I'll tell you like what all the accessories you require for maintaining the wig. So most importantly, so for keeping the wig, you just require a small, small kind of wig stand. So if, because you are buying the wig, so that if you just keep it in a box, it just get folded. So it's better just to keep a mannequin like this. So can you see this? We have just kept a wig on this, so that the shape is not going to get changed. It's going to the shape is going to be intact. So can you wear it like this? So this is just a wig stand. And uh, for wearing a full wig, you can just go for something called as wig caps, like this. And you get in two colors. One is the skin color, and one is the black color. You can go for wig caps like this. And for uh, we suggest for any wig for while combing, we just suggest this kind of combs. So it has got the knot with bristles, so it will be very easy to comb. So that you know the tangling will not be there. So we suggest this kind of combs. And uh, what we suggest is. Uh, for just uh, doing the styling for men's wig, you can just use this roller kind of combs, roller brushes. And for wearing hair extensions, you can just go for the style comb like this for wearing hair extensions. And we have, uh, and we provide uh, the shampoos with all the wigs and hair attachments, hair extensions. This is the shampoo and this is the conditioner, and this is a really very good quality. So we just suggest this shampoo. And for uh, air bonding, we have this different types of tapes. So this is all double-sided tapes we have to use for air bonding and air fixing. And you can use the flat brush for combing uh, wigs with the long hair, so that you know, it will be very easy. And use the soft, soft bristles like this. It should be very soft, so that you know the air doesn't get break. And we have something. Uh, the tools for air bonding. Right? So this is the tools. What when we do that air bonding for the uh, women? So we use this kind of tools. And we have this tonsil like this for keratin air bonding. And we have this machine for keratin air bonding. This is this is the machine like this. this is the machine. And for air fixing, we have this tapes. This is a double side tips like this. And for uh, clip on air extensions, for air fixing for men. So we use, we have different uh, types of clips. The smaller one, the medium one, and the bigger one. Can you see this? This is the smaller one. This is the bigger one. And this is the medium one which is used for air extensions. And this is for a men's air attachment. And this is used for ladies air, small piece air pieces like this and we have all this glues and air uh, release systems and we have uh, something called as uh, air positioning loose space and this is a little wand and we have this brush for cleaning there it's uh, really very useful and we use uh, shampoos, conditioners and we have this air release systems and we have got a gel for air styling. This is got a spray. And this is the spray glue, what we use for the beards and mustaches. This is the glue. So this is all the products what we normally use. So what I feel is, you know, maintenance is very important. So to reduce the wear and tear. So it's something like prevention is better than cure after getting spoiled. If the wig gets damaged and again uh, you know you have to come here and we do the servicing here and otherwise you can just do it out just can just buy these products we can do it at your home so if it's not possible just call us and uh, you know we'll still you the solution how to do that okay so thank you for watching this video yeah bye